Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome back to Let's Play Killer Escape. Now, I'm still lost in this, uh, this lovely environment that this creepy guy has locked me into. So, I'm not exactly sure where I'm supposed to be going. But, ah, ooh, okay, spider webs. So, I'm kind of wandering around a little bit lost, but... Look to the left. Is there pipes destabilized? What's the diagram? Central controller. I'm not even sure what this means. I'm sure that if I could read that. Uh -huh. <laughs> Another spider web. Okay. Okay. Pipes destabilized. That's that. There's got to be something. There's a spider web. There's another fuse. Okay. So we're the, okay. We've made some progress. Even if I climb up, it's too rotten. Another spider web. Okay, the spider webs are getting a little. I missed one. Okay, gotta go slow. Gotta go slow. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on, man. It's like it's really torturing me. This is this is painful. Okay, you got to go extremely slow on that. <sighs> okay, let's see how that's looking. Looks like everything is done. I still got apparently one more fail safe, looks like. And then I've got the overdrive that I still have to activate. I'm not exactly sure where those other things are. So, that's done. There's another spider web down here. <laughs> the first time I saw the spider web, there's. Oh! So, six. Genius 620. It's wonderful. A key wheel. Let's see what that note says. We've got another new note. I think that's the note. He keeps reminding us that there is no escape. It's almost as if he wants us to try. Maybe that makes us more sport. I will escape, and I will kill him in the process. I will get out of here, and this guy will go to the chair for what he has done to us down here down her. <laughs> he feeds us dog food and dirty water. He tortures us day and night. He burns and disfigures us, then kills us one by one and carts us off to the incinerator. He gets off on fumes. He will be the one burning in hell when I get out of here. Okay. So, there's another web. And another fuse. I'm so glad I saw that web. I would have probably been hunting for that fuse for like ever. I've already looked at the lockers. There's nothing else unless there's a spider web. I don't think there is. Okay. Back to the room. I've already looked at you. Yes, I have. I've already looked at you. Yes, I have. Back to the storage room. Okay. Now I've got the key wheel so I can turn on this thing. Okay. It ought to be pretty darn close. All right, everything's almost maxed out except for the overdrive. So what's stopping the overdrive? Ah! It now makes sense. Red, green, blue. I'm just, uh, these probably have to be in a certain order. I'm sure it does. Fuel is full. Um, how do I start you? Are these supposed to be in different places? Start generator. If it is connected, it has fuel and four fuses. Okay. Connected. Connected. Where would it not be connected? 
If you will take us full. Control panel. Why would it not be connected? I'm trying to figure out why, why it wouldn't be connected. That's That can be the only thing that would be stopping me from being able to turn that thing on. And it should be connected. It looks like it's connected. I successfully deactivated the cooling system. It looks like a pipe is missing. Now I see that. Ding! Okay. Now we can start the thing. Okay. Are we maxed out yet? Okay, I'm liking that. There is a failsafe somewhere that I have missed. This is what this is going to be. This is the story of my life. I'm going to miss one relay. And it's going to completely screw my whole world up. Okay, let's see. Is there another one in here? That one's done. That is not a relay. That dead body scared the crap out of me. And for those of y'all that, that, that missed that awesome scare, I, I encourage you to watch part one because I scream like a little girl sometimes. There we are. Beautiful. Thank you so very much. Now... Maybe the thing blows up. Yep. Turn the overdrive generator. Blow this thing up. Okay. Let's blow this thing up and see what happens. Yay! Oh boy! Hi! <laughs> I blew you up. I hope that's the end of you. Ooh, you're creepy. Yes! Alright, you have escaped the cell, killing the burner in the process. The information you have is vital to the authorities. You must keep going until you're free. Well done for getting this far. You are truly a born survivor. Click here to continue. Okay, so it took me forever and a day to do this. A whopping 28 minutes. The last part was 20 minutes. This was about 8 minutes long. Uh, final score 16,000. Probably not a high score, but but I will say this. That was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that game. Um, the puzzles were a little bit tricky, but once I figured out what I was doing, it was, it was, it was just finding everything. Um... But some of them were very well hidden. Uh, that's all I've got for this one. That was Killer Escape. If you like what you see, guys, make sure that you click on the link below to try this game out for yourself. There's also a Killer Escape Part 2 and 3. Uh, I'll probably be playing those, and I'll have those ready for you sometime later this week, I hope. I've also got another game. I had a developer send me an email. I asked me to try his game out. So I won't tell you guys what game that is just yet. You'll have to find out for yourself. But, um... Hopefully it's a it's a good game. I, I've got a lot of I've seen the stills for it and I've seen some of the gameplay footage. Not enough to ruin it for me, but I've seen a little bit and so far it looks really great. So I'm looking forward to that. Again, my name is Jared. Thank you guys for checking out my channel. Be sure and click subscribe if you like what you see, and I'll make sure to keep some of these great videos coming your way. Also, click on the annotations at the end of the video for more videos that I've done. And as always, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.